Hey everybody, it's about 9.30 on Tuesday morning, and I am back to do um, another eBay haul. It's a small one. I told you in the last eBay haul that I had some more stuff um, coming because I just was bored one night and um, spent a while on eBay looking for stuff, so... Finally, the rest of it has arrived. Let me get started. Do this with one hand. Okay, that aside. Okay, now I remember. Um, somebody okay oh, how cute so as you can see a pair of toms and I don't know I wasn't really specifically looking for um this brand of shoe I was just looking for shoes in general but I came across these and they are in great condition I can um, wash them up and um, they'll be good to go. Got a little wear in them, but not a whole lot. Yeah, they pretty much, the colors are um, red, green, turquoise, and blue, and purple, and white, of course. So, they're so cute, and this is a size 8. So these are for Layla. And of course they will go for the rest of the girls. And if I'm not mistaken, they were um, $4. So, those are cute. I'm going to open this one. This is easy. Okay. This is a dress. So, the backwards, sorry about the camera work, but, um, baby gap, Ugh. this is a size three, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, that's a three, and you can see it's cinched at the waist, and then at the shoulder, and then on the sleeve. And this is just so cute. Um, we have a Jimboree dress like this that is um, going to be paired with some tight skin or some leggings because it's too short for Layla, but she can still fit it. And um, I think the baby can fit it. I sh she just hasn't uh, worn it because it's just now her season, but it's short sleeve. Anywho, this is... Um, Pink and brown and turquoise, and some light blue, and like a salmon color. So, really, really cute for this fall. Uh, lots of colors to um, pair this with. But I know we already have some tight, some white, and some, some pink tights that'll go just fine with it. So excited for this and it's pretty much um excellent use condition. Doesn't look like it was worn much. There's no stains on it. It just needs to be washed and um hung. So what do we have here? Okay, another pair of shoes. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I was on a shoe hunt. I don't, I don't know. I kind of stopped once they got older buying shoes because they had so many shoes when they were little and they really didn't even wear them. They just ended up, you know, sitting there. And so now I tend to only, honestly, they, I just bought them their second pair of shoes um, last week before I bought these. So, um, you know, they're basically in the same pair because they like 
you know, once we buy them a pair of shoes, that's what they want to wear every day. And I don't want to, uh, you know, steal their joy. But, um, you know, we have the old pair. They can still fit them. It's just they wear them sporadically, but they're stuck on one new pair. So I let them wear that one new pair until they, you know, pretty much need some new ones. And um, that's about it. They generally tend to go with everything, but sometimes not. But if I put them on a pair of shoes, they'll take them off anyway. Like Layla has a pair of um, gold Crazy 8 um, Mary Janes. She will wear those shoes every day with everything, regardless to what I put on her. So, you know, you can tell she put her own shoes on. But um, if that's the way she's comfortable, then I just let her be. But this is a pair of um, Jim Bree Mary Janes, and they have the little pink um, flowers on them. And these are, these are brand new. And this is also, I think, a size 8. Not too sure. It may be a 7, but I really think it's an 8. And so, um, yeah, it's an 8. She has some things that this will go with as well. It's a real pretty plum color. So she'll be excited. She's a girly girl, and she is a shoe girl. It's just, you know, once she finds the one pair that she likes, she wants to keep wearing those. And she'll wear the other ones just around the house and things like that. But um, she'll be happy to see these. And then we have another pair of Tom's. Okay, this is boy pair. Again, I was not really looking for um, this brand of shoe. It just happened to be what came up. Okay, I got it. And these are so cute. So, the um, animal print. There's kind of hard to make out, but elephants and see what else is on here. It's just elephants, just different color elephants. But um, minimal wear. You need cleaned up. It's a little scuff at the toe, but um, for the price, and again, I paid $4 for these two. In fact, all of the shoes um, were $4. So it's a really good deal for the brand of shoe. Um, these are, and also an 8. So, he'll be able to wear these for a little bit if he likes them. But, um, yeah. Easy on and off. It's a little Velcro. And, great little shoe to wear on to the next one. I'll look at, um, consignment sale and I go there. And try to get him some more. Other than that, it's a little shoe haul, and then we have one more um, find. And I have been looking for these colors rather than um, plain white. So, of course, this is for the baby. And um, I have a lot of white ones, but I love these little crossover shirts. And um, I'm going to put these in the in the bag and take to the hospital. The kind with the little cuffs on them. And they're just um they're Gerber brand, but like I said, newborn and preemie sizes, they're really scarce. You really can't find them in the store. Um it's just randomly. And then if you do, they're just the white ones. So again, like I said, I didn't want to find or I didn't need any white ones. I was looking for a more or less color because I just didn't feel like um, going through the process of dying some, but that would have been my next next bit, just to go ahead and um, dye some uh, some of the white ones. This one's a little pink and white, 
cute little tramp. It has a little bow detail up here. And this one is a uh, it's a onesie. It's so cute. And they're not stained at all. And I actually, I paid a dollar for these. So, awesome. And this one is really cute with the stripes. Oh, I'm going to keep looking because I really would like to get a couple more of these. If possible. So, getting a little thing. So brand new for a dollar. You cannot beat that. And um, like I said, here's my little haul. Sorry, it's kind of all over the place, but I wanted to open the packages while I actually did the video. And I guess I will end here. But um, in doing that, I have another video that I'm going to upload today. And, um, probably two. I haven't done a pregnancy vlog in, I think, about three weeks. I'm going to go ahead and do that. And the other one is, um, misconceptions of raising a large family. Something that's just been on my mind. And, um, I'm thinking, um, that's a good, good subject for the time. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and let's see if I forgot anything. Oh, the dress, the dress was, uh, the dress was three fifty. So, um, what, about 20 bucks roughly for all this stuff? I don't know. Um, but, you know, for, for what it is, shoes and things like that. I think I did pretty good. And, um, no, I haven't been to the thrift store this week. <laughs> I haven't been since last week. I've just been kind of tired, especially since I've been at work. But I need to, um, I need to work on the closet. That's what I'm doing. All the clothes that I've bought in previous hauls, um, like I said, I had, hadn't put them away. I just had to finally got them washed, and I'm going to start, um, after this and and um after this video and start putting them away and then i'll um, make the other videos and get them uploaded throughout the course of the day so oh excuse me it's tired um i'll talk to you guys later <laughs> bye